Satan, before me no God was formed, nor shall there be any after me. Next chapter, Isaiah 44, God says that he doesn't even know another God. Deuteronomy 6, 4, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. Do you love the one God over all reality? Or is your God just God over this world or over his particular dominion? Are there worlds that your God did not create? Then you worship an idol. Are there worlds that your Jesus did not create in some distant universe or some distant reality? Then you blaspheme Jesus. Jesus created, according to John 1, 3, all things were made through him. Without him was not made anything that was made. Colossians 1, he created all things visible and invisible, whether thrones or dominions or rulers or authorities. Jesus Christ created absolutely everything. It's from him, it's through him, it's to him, it's for him. You don't worship God if your God is not the one true God of gods, the most high. Why did God kick butt in Egypt? Why did God put the flags down? Why did God kill the firstborn children, the firstborn sons of the Egyptians? The scriptures say to make a name for himself, to show himself God above all other gods. What are God, all the other gods you're Jehovah, talking about? Jehovah, Yahweh, Adonai, Elohim, the one true God. He kicked butt in Egypt to show everyone Elohim, that all other gods are idols. Elohim is plural. God is the one Elohim God. is plural for gods. You guys need to realize, why did God create everything? God did not create the heavens and the earth ultimately for you. Psalm 19, Psalm 19 says, the heavens declare the glory of God. All things were created to show off how awesome God is. 